Why, hello there, everybody. I am the Admiral, and we're back with another exciting battle for our uh, newest OU team that I'm trying to work through. So we're going to lead off with Rhyperior against Talonflame. That's a good one for me, and I go for the Mega Horn because I know he's going to switch. And I missed. <laughs> that would have been such a good play. It didn't matter if you went to Greninja, Gardevoir, or Espeon. It probably would have been an Oko. But it wasn't, so it isn't. He's going to switch to Espeon. Back to Earth of my Leech Seed. Now, as you can tell, the time of this video is not very long, so it's going to be tough for me to stay up to date. So I need to stop, and I'm stuck in here because of Magnezone's Magnet Pull, and I'm going to miss the Leech Seed again, which would have kept me alive for a little longer, would have dealt more damage to him. So we're off to a fast start with all the hacks playing against me. But on the positive side, he still can't really kill me in one hit. He still can't kill me in one hit. And am I going to hit this time? No, I'm going to get critted. Well, one down. I've been hacked so many times, so obviously I'm going to go for the EQ here. And he's got a Steelix with a balloon. Whoa. Who? Rock blasted. Hey, it actually hit. Woohoo! I actually hit something. I actually hit something. He sets up the SR, which is not very good for me. It's not horrible either. I'm going to get a crit of my EQ. Didn't really matter that much. He's going to EQ me. Um, and then I'm going to rock pop. Why do I rock polish? Uh, okay. Well, I can take it like a champ, I guess. And then I'm going to EQ him. But the problem here is if he has anything with priority, which I'm pretty sure he does, he's got Greninja with Ice. Oh, no he doesn't. He's just flat out scarfed or faster than me, I guess. But, he's got the ability protein, which changes his type to whatever move he uses. I've got Espeon, I'm going to go ahead and use Hidden Power, which is... I believe it's Fire, but I'm not entirely sure. He doesn't know what it is, though. He just knows it's not Psychic, and he's going to Mega Evolve into Gardevoir, which apparently doesn't show up on this website. It probably does now, because I'm commentating this well after actually recording it. So I'm going to get a Toxic on it. What's it gonna do? It's gonna size shock me for nothing because my Gliscor's got is a physically bulky defensive one. Like EQ, and he's gonna call mine again, which is great for me because he obviously doesn't have leftover since he may evolve, and which means that I can protect from here. And his guard is gonna go down to the 18% damage he's gonna take from poison. Woohoo! Yay! So that's I'm I'm back tied, I guess. I'm going to switch to Greninja, which means I obviously don't want to stay in and take the Ice Beam. I don't really have anybody who does, so I'm going to switch into Espeon, who dies. Yay. Well, that's just great. I'm in a tough spot here. He's Ice-type, and I don't know what he wants to do now, so I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, what do I do? Do I DD? Yeah, I do. I DD here. He sends an Espeon, so I know I want to get that thing dead quickly. It's not physically defensive, so a Waterfall should take it out, and it does. So, we're back even at 3, and from here, I don't think he can do anything. I'm going to go ahead and sub here just to see what he wants to do. And he's going to T-Bolt, and maybe he wanted to Bolt Switch to go somewhere else, I'd be perfectly fine. And pause, why do I... I don't actually remember why I paused this. Um, shoot, why did I... did I type something in chat? I don't remember what I did here. Oh well, sorry about that. He... oh! He switches, and I don't know why. That's what it was. I don't understand why he switched. His Greninja can't touch me. But I can take out his Greninja from here. And actually, that that actually just cost him his Greninja without doing any damage to me. Now, he's got priority with Gale Wings, and it's going to... Oh, he sacked it. Okay, that makes more sense now. And so, my... um. Candy ass, the Gliscor here should be fine to take the Brave Bird. It's most definitely a CV Talon Flame. I'll take it perfectly fine. He'll get hit by the recoil. I'll get a Toxic on it. And it looks like I'm going to be perfectly fine because both my remaining Pokemon have better speed than Magnezone and they both have EQ. So his Brave Bird I protect. 62. It doesn't matter if he takes me out. I don't know why I paused again. I, I actually have absolutely no idea why he paused again. Why I paused again, why he paused again, why I paused again, I don't know. But I live, he's fine. I roost. Oh, that was a pretty good play on my part. I'm surprised. Wow. 
I'm back up to 76%, although it doesn't matter because my Haxorus is scarfed with EQ. I'm perfectly fine. I live a flash cannon, and that's going to give me the win. So I want to thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you guys all next time in the future battles. Peace.